Hello and welcome to today's video which is about the fabulous Eric Johnson Rosewood Stratocaster. Stick around to the end of the video where I'll go through the guitar in more detail and tell you all about the specifications. But first, let's hear it in action. Here's the Eric Johnson Rosewood strap then. Looks like any other strap from a distance, they all do I suppose. So what makes this one different? Well, this particular one is in a Tropical Turquoise. It's also available in Lucerne Aqua Fire Mist, both beautiful nitrocellulose finishes on this. Um, where to start? So it's got parchment plastics, so slightly off-white, um, three-ply guard and switch tip and knobs. The knobs are um, basically a master volume and you've got your neck tone and also a bridge tone on this as well. Uh, it's a vintage 57 style tremolo on there. Um, you can see I'm not a big user of the tremolo and in fact the stick is still on this one uh, covering the tremolo arm and probably protecting the, uh, the retaining spring underneath. So it's got a wicked little rosewood fretboard on this. A flat one, it's a 12 inch radius compared to some of the modern compounds or maybe nine and a half inch and even some of the vintage sort of seven and a quarter. So this one's really quite a flat, flat neck in that respect. But it has a brilliant binding all the way through. Um, seen very occasionally in the 60s and not very often, especially on a Strat. So it just makes it kind of funky, different and quite unusual. Just a quick note on the fit of the neck actually. Um, you may be able to see, I'll just come around, but, but the actual neck pocket 
is really quite quite something on this the fit and finish is superb and i have to say uh, the eric johnson strat in my opinion is probably well it's one of the very finest guitars that's not a custom shop guitar it really is so beautiful it's really resonant and well put together so the neck itself is a maple neck which is quarter sawn they are all quarter sawn on this model which gives it extra strength and rigidity and you might be able to pick up some of the, the sort of grain pattern in the headstock it's not that discernible but then the quarter sawns don't tend to be uh, you've got vintage uh, tuners on there and the nut is a bone nut a standard so that's that's that um what else can i tell you so the pickups are specially voiced pickups so they are uh, Eric Johnson model specific only available um, for this particular guitar and they have countersunk pickup mounting screws as well so that was just a sort of personal preference that they had I think no real functional difference so if we turn the guitar over it's got very deep contours again it's based on a 57 guitar so it's really nice deep body contours on here which makes it super comfortable to play. In fact, I play this guitar an awful lot acoustically and don't actually plug it in. It's, uh, it's such a resonant guitar, it's quite incredible. So on the back here, you can see uh, the vintage style block. It is painted silver and there's no paint between the, um, the base plate and the actual block. So that kind of um, improves the contact area. You'll see that there's no cover plate and there aren't even any screws to mount the cover plate either. So that was just, that was never fitted with one and never intended to have one as per Eric Johnson's preferences. You've then got the engraved EJ neck plate and you can see some of the sort of quarter sawn detail in the neck possibly as I move along. As I say, not terribly discernible, um, but there you have it. And then you've got a really nice really smooth heel uh, sorry the, uh, the joint just there is super smooth and the heel is also beautifully fettled so that's really comfortable to play but quite interesting in this as well is you've got the staggered tuners staggered height so that gives you the optimum break angle for the strings which means you don't have to have a string tree so that cleans up the uh, the face of the headstock reduces the friction um, and all that kind of good stuff so there she is, there's the Eric Johnson guitar. And also what, what's really fantastic about it is it comes in this beautiful G&G &G case, which has got a gorgeous deep gold plush lining. Also comes with, get the focus there, also comes with a really nice strap and all the usual accoutrement as they say. And the coil cords, really old school but beautiful fender coiled cable and you get the ashtray in there and of course the the tremolo arm and that's all good stuff so that's that and also the uh, just finally on this the case itself is kind of a blonde well it's more of a goldy sort of color quite unique i think to this model but again it just looks absolutely stunning so there she is and uh there's the overview of the Eric Johnson Strat. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, please do like the video if indeed you did and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. We have a bunch of guitars coming through, especially Fenders. We're a big fan of Strats on this channel. And uh, spread the love. Please uh, share and tell your friends. And um, we'll be back soon. Thanks again. Bye bye.